this uh, village has won awards yes, um, and it won an award for the prettiest village in Spain um, and they have to whitewash the properties once a year and always have sort of pretty coloured baskets um, building outside or on the walls and uh, I suppose it's to attract tourism but it is beautiful, it's lovely as you can see The heat's getting up now. Um, it's about 10.30 to guess. I've got my watch on. I'd say it's about 10.30. Um, it was nice and cool at 9 o'clock. But you can feel the heat now. God, isn't it? Popping and panting. Oh. restaurant here um, is overlooking the main square um, further down in town and it's called the garden restaurant it's lovely so quite fancy coming here even if it's you know for a tapas or something if they do it lovely views Pete's just rung me to say, where are you? So I said, I'm at Restaurante El Mirador, just outside looking at it, so he's going to try and find it. <laughs> Amongst all these little cobble streets and alleyways, it'll take him forever. But he has got quite a good sense of direction, unlike me, unlike myself. Beautiful. It's getting hot now, even though I'm high up. Um, yeah, pretty hot, especially when you're walking up the steps, all the steps. Back to the 
streets and as you just seen um, came across the, the Restaurante El Mirador, Pete's joined me and we're having a few drinks or one drink which is the equivalent of about five drinks in the UK <laughs> isn't it? So, um, so yeah, cheers, I'll just pan the camera around so you can see what it's like, it's lovely, really pretty. That's the little bar there. Stone Wally. Quite a few people coming now. We were on our own when we first came, came in. But, um, quite a few people are finding it as they've walked up the steep steps. <coughs> yeah, it's lovely there. It's really nice. Pete said he could sit here all day. <laughs> Didn't you? It's one of those places that you can just sit and watch the world go by for hours on end. Lovely.